Hello everyone, welcome back to the Weekend Soft Roading Channel. Today we're going to talk about the new tent that I got that's really similar to the Gazelle T4 but at a very low price point. So today we're going to be talking about this tent, my first impressions and also uh, just a quick review of it. This is my first time opening it. Uh, so as you can see it comes in a bag. bag's not that durable. It's pretty thin. Might have to upgrade that. This bag is not waterproof but the uh, tent is waterproof and I'll put the specs here uh, in the video. Uh, these these straps I put on myself because they came with some dingy string straps that weren't really good uh, like this it just came in this so I'll put these straps on myself and again we'll, we'll crack this open. The tent does come with some guide stakes here it also comes with uh, the guide ropes to tie down all on this bag but uh, these are pretty cheap so if you do want to upgrade them you can so very easy to set up you just have to pull these tabs uh, very similar to my old tent but this one's a lot bigger and that's the reason why i got it so you just got to pull five corners so four on uh, each side and then the roof and then that will pop up the tent all right so after popping all the corners this is what it looks like lots of ventilation so right now we got it all closed uh, you just have to put this rain fly on top by attaching the poles and then attaching these to the metal thing and then inside this is one of the doors there's two doors very roomy in here I'll show you what that looks like so this is the interior of the Como top tent so everything is seam sealed which is lovely so as you can see here in the corner uh, everything is seam sealed uh, all the seams here for the zippers are going to be seam sealed. Uh, these are not going to be YKK zippers. Uh, rather, they're going to be SPS uh, zippers, which are pretty good. I'm, I'm not. We'll see what the long term longevity is. Uh, but lots of mesh windows, as you can see, we got them cracked open right now to check out the views. Uh, there's a mesh window here, uh, there. That is another door, mesh window, mesh window, open mesh window door with mesh and then if you don't want to put the rain top on this is all mesh on top as well uh, but we want to put the rain top on uh, just in case it rains since we live in Vancouver so again everything is seam sealed there's pockets uh, everywhere or not everywhere but there's pockets there that's a pocket uh, there's a pocket in the back over there as well and then there's also a roof pocket with a hook for your lamp as well so, so far, first impressions of the interior, uh, everything's pretty good. Uh, the material here, I think, uh, I'll put the specs of the material uh, here so you can compare it to other tents that you may be looking at. But there, all the hardware seems pretty solid. Like these poles are pretty thick. And here's the hub system that uh, everyone wants to see. That's the hub system, looks pretty solid. Um, we'll see how long this lasts. Again, it was, Compared to a Gazelle tent, it was significantly uh, cheaper. And I'll put links down below so you can review what that looks like. Uh, but again, let me know if you have any questions. I will talk to you soon. Have a wonderful day. Bye.